and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code PULA at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team Video Guide. And today, I'm going to go over the best budget beast in Madden. I have been one of these videos in about probably almost, gotta say, close to three weeks in this point, maybe almost a month. And since all this new stuff has come out, guys, and the market has crashed, that does mean that budget beasts just get a whole lot cheaper. I, hopefully you guys know at this point that pretty much the crash market means that all the lower cards went down a lot so we are able to greatly increase our budget piece list and greatly increase the potential for a budget team because you can afford a lot more for a lot less now so let's get into this list guys but just want to let you guys know if you're into the channel go down below hit that subscribe button turn that notification bell boys come join the family comment down below let me know what's up let me know if you guys think any other budget piece should be on this list and give this video a big thumbs up and guys we're super close to 20k. Things have slowed down quite tremendously, but we're still chugging our way there. Now let's get into this list. So, budget beast, guys. We made quite a few additions to the budget beast list. We've pretty much over like revamped it entirely because things are so cheap now. We're able to even look at higher filters. So coming at number 10, guys, it's a run heavy year. You always gotta have your big boy in the trenches ready to go. Geno Atkins 48k is a solid, solid buy. Now, 90 overall defensive tackle, 75 speed, 81 excel. Those, that's decent right there. For defensive tackle, it's not bad. 87 strike, 78 tackle. Now, here's where it gets good. 91 play rec, 85 block, 89 power move. Now, most defensive tackles don't have a uh, pass rush. At, uh, he'll have a 90 when you either power up or just toss one chem on him. He'll have a 90 already, which would put him a, make him a threshold pass rusher, which is really good for a, a budget team. You really need the pass rush. And sometimes people don't really focus on their centers or anyone in the interior. Sometimes they focus more on their tackles, and not even that, just having a 90 threshold for power power is going to be really great. And you can decently stop the run, but what matters is that you're going to be getting some pressure up the middle because typically on a theme team, uh, not a budget, a, theme, a budget team, sometimes the biggest issue with them is that you just get completely overpowered because you can't pass rush name all day in the pocket. So even if their team wasn't better than yours, they're still going to have time. So you got to make sure you get at least get that pressure up. Now coming at number nine on the list is a guy that we kind of forgot about in Madden this year. He has not been a... An amazing card by any means since his mud heroes card but his mud heroes card is still great for a budget team that's jalen ramsey jalen ramsey's kind of falling off the uh the face of the earth and madden this year but 91 card still goes strong 88 speed 88 excel 85 agility 89 jumping 90 play rec 90, 87 play rec 92 man 90 zone and 92 press so he's a threshold coverage guy he'll be able to block you down in zone lock you down in man and even press you up for the small price of 68k that is a budget piece by if I've, if I've ever seen one and to make it even better i'm pretty sure he usually has a pretty good hit power which is important with the run heavy year because he can force fumbles which is another thing that not many corners can do 75 hit power that is really good for a cornerback don't get me wrong now number eight guys we have we went a little secondary heavy today number eight is another cornerback another solid one if you put all of these guys that i'm going to mention all together kind of a pretty solid team for a pretty cheap price so Robert Alford is the second one, 38k, super cheap price, he gets 91 speed, 91 excel, 89 agility, 92 jumping, 85 play rank, 85 man, 87 zone, 88 press. If you put lockdown on him times three, you do get him to like a 90 zone and you get him to a 90 press, which means that overall, this car will be really athletic, he'll be overall a threshold coverage guy in certain aspects, and you put him with you put him with um, Jalen Ramsey and you have a super, super solid secondary getting built already. Next on the list. This guy actually is a recurring guy from the last list, and that's, because, that's just primarily because he's one of the best cards in the game, even as his base elite, and he's super cheap. 46k, and he gets 74 speed, 81 excel. That's just decent, right? But he gets 89 strength, 81 tackle, 88 play rec, 86 block shed, 88 power move, and 85 finesse move. You put, pat, you put a pass rush on him, or you, even if you just power him up, you can get his block shots close to 90. You can get his power move above a 90, his play rec above a 90, his strength above a 90. He becomes threshold at a lot of places for a very cheap price of 46k. And you can power him up, but he is the first card in the power up. So go from here to here. It's not going to cost you that many coins at all. Next on the list is a guy that you should have on your team already. And if you don't, you're missing out. Finally, his base legend is super cheap, which means that you can finally take advantage of having him on your budget teams. That's Lawrence Taylor, base legend. Once I find him, it says he goes for about 84k. I've seen him for as low as 45. I'm not 45. 65, 75. It really just depends on the time of day you're looking for him. But this card is a beast. And guys, as a, a slight alternative I want to toss in here because I do see him right here. Demarcus Lawrence. I was between these two. I was between the two Lawrences before. But if you want an outside linebacker, this Lawrence right here, guys, 84 speed, 87 excel. Best speed you're gonna find it right outside for this price. 89 power move, 87 finesse move. 
That's what you gotta care about, right? He's gonna be a threshold pass rusher if you power him up or you just chem him up. He's gonna be great at stopping the run as well as being super athletic. But if you don't wanna go with him, guys, a budget, a more budgety option slightly would be Demarcus Lawrence. Not by much, but Demarcus Lawrence gets 75 speed, 83 excel. But what really matters here is that he gets 92 finesse move, 85 block, and 88 play rec. Chemmed up, he's gonna get past 90 play rec and he's gonna have really good finesse move as well as he comes with pre built in abilities, as you guys can see right here, which is. Uh, reach elite finesse specialist and edge threat guys overall just a very very good set of things and he comes with free built ability so don't forget he's always a great option when it comes to theme teams next gonna be completing the secondary right here another guy that i've always wanted this year never really got around to powering up but he's a solid solid budget piece and that's champ bailey 78k really good price 90 speed 90 excel 91 agility he's like baby Deion sanders 86 jumping, 86 play rack, 91 man, 85 zone, 83 press. Chemmed up, powered up and everything. He's going to get to 90 play rack, going to come close to 90 zone. Going to get like an 86 press, going to have like a 94 man coverage. Great speed, great excel. Going to be great in a blitzing scheme. Okay, so we've covered for the secondary. Now for the quarterback. Guys, this guy, one of the one of the cards that I had at quarterback most of the year. Very glitchy, and he's kind of at a cheap price now. Lamarcus, Lamarcus, Lamar Jackson great price right about now 77k for his base team of the week card 90 speed that's all you got to see 90 speed 85 throw power 86 throw short 82 throw mid 82 throw deep 90 throw under pressure 88 throw on the run and 86 play action guys you really want to take advantage of him purchase his power card with him power him up all the way and you will be getting a seriously dangerous quarterback he'll get a skate artist he'll have a 90 what like a powered up at like a 91 speed has a great throw power if you put go deep on him or you can just put west coast and get his throw short to a 90 but other than that, accuracy just aside, he's very, very fast, very athletic. And on a budget team, quite honestly, having great accuracy is not going to help because you're going to be getting pass rush all game. You're kind of going to, you're going to, you're going to want to have that mobile quarterback to escape some pressure situations. Next, we're going to add some linemen on there. We need the big boys. David DeCash for 58k, one of the best budget right guards because he has a 90 across the board. You put any, you put any cam on him like zone run, or you have a John Madden rushing anything. He's going to get all 90 pass blocking, all 90 run blocking, 90 strength, and close 90 awareness. Guys, that's a wrap. I don't got to say much more about that. Best right guard in the game when it comes to budgety teams. I just dropped him off my team like two days ago, and my team's right. My team's 95, so I've, I've been using him for quite a while. He's super solid. I start to feel the difference now, but that's because I'm versing like 97 overall teams, but he lasted a long time. One of the best budget guards in the game. Next, we got Frank Clark. Frank Clark, again, a really, really solid budget option. Again, these presses aren't always accurate. It could be a little bit cheaper because I'm not filtering it. 91 right end, 83 speed, 89 excel. For a right end budget, super good. 87 strength, really good. 76 tag, a little low. 92 play rec's amazing. 68 block shed's not great, but he gets 93 power move and 85 finesse. I told you guys, you're gonna need to stop the, you're gonna need to pass rush. You're gonna need to really pass rush considering linemen are gonna probably be holding you all day. So the better you can get your pass rushes, the more you can counteract that. But 93 power move's insane, plus 92 play rec, plus he has all that speed and excel. Looking like a budget piece right there. And coming at number one on the list. Now, a lot of other guys could have deserved number one here. But I really like this card. I think this card plays re really well. And that's Dalvin Cook. Dalvin Cook, Blitz Redux. I just saw him for 67k before. Remember, these prices are kind of weird because they're not like the most openly available cards all the time. So just make sure you're checking the block when you before you buy one of these cards. 92 overall halfback. 90 speed. 91 excel. 93 agility. 88 carry. 88 looseness. And 90 break tackle. Now, I've had Breida on here. But Breida didn't really have the break tackle. Didn't have the agility and things like that. Dalvin Cook's looking super solid. Looking really good. Now, another budget back was Saquon Barkley. So that's what I'm showing here. Saquon Barkley, Mud Heroes, is another great budget back. But whichever one's cheaper comes down to you. Saquon has better carrying, better catching, better trucking, better break tackle. Dalvin only has better elusiveness. But remember, Saquon is powered up. Powered up Dalvin will probably be better than the Saquon. But if you don't want to power him up, Saquon's stock is very, very similar. So it really comes down to what you prefer. These both are budget backs that you should have on your team. Dalvin just played very, he plays very good. Despite his stats, he really does play above his stats. I highly recommend him. But if not, Saquon Barkley is like the 1B here. Just want to show him in here too. But guys, that is about it for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy the budget piece. Let's head back and over to this man screen over here. Get out of here. Hopefully there was content today. If there was content, hopefully you would have seen a video at by 1030. If you're not seeing a video at that time based on content, then EA sucked today and they didn't give us anything. But hopefully you guys enjoy this budget piece list. If you are new to the channel, make sure to go down below. Hit that subscribe button, turn that notification bell, boys. Come join the family. Make sure to comment down below if you have any other budget piece to add to the list. You know, I try my best to add as many guys as I can, but there's hundreds and thousands of players in this game. It gets, you know, there's just so many. Sometimes you might miss a few guys. So if you have any gems, any diamonds that I kind of missed in the, in, you know, in the rut, drop them down below. And make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Can we get to 150 likes on this video, guys? That'd be greatly appreciated. 
and make sure to comment down below. Thank you guys. Enjoy the rest of your day. I'm out. See you in the next video. Peace.